Hi guys, I'm Jess and welcome back to Magical Mystery. Today we have got another magical review for you guys. I am going to be reviewing this stunning wand that I got for Christmas. Now this white packaging is a clear indication probably to some of you that this is a noble collection item. And as it states on the front, it is very, very fragile. I am absolutely in love with this wand. This wand was a Christmas gift from my mum. It was not gifted to me by Noble Collection. I'm not sponsored with them. I don't work with them. But this is what the wand box looks like. Now this wand box is a very very different style to the usual wand boxes that you see. It's plain black and it has the name on the end and I don't know. There you go. It says Jacob Kowalski and it has his name on both ends of the wand box. I was so excited when I got these. Now this is obviously a Secrets of Dumbledore wand that you can, as I said, purchase from Noble Collection. The inside of his box is very, very different to a usual Noble Collection box. There is no nice material going over. There's no sort of Ollivander's wand design because obviously this wand, as we know, spoilers from the film if you haven't seen it, was designed by Dumbledore for Jacob. This is not an Ollivander's wand. It's not a real sort of wizard wand, I guess. It was created to look like one so that he would be able to blend in and if he did any magic or looked like he was doing any magic it was usually casted by Lally. Love, love Lally. Can't wait to see more of her. If they do any more Fantastic Beast movies which is looking very unlikely. Now I wanted this wand when they were available for pre-order. There are loads of Secrets of Dumbledore ones that I wanted. But when they were available for pre-order, I unfortunately decided that I couldn't afford to pay for all the ones I wanted. So I did ask Mum if I could have them for Christmas. And I, out of the selection, I think Mum chose the best option. She knows me so so well this wand is just stunning so if we look at the top of the wand here it's quite thick you've got a round top with some patterns this is clearly supposed to look like wood and you've got different shades of light brown and dark brown it is also in style, reminds me a bit of Bellatrix's wand and also looking at my wand display of Scorpius's wand a little bit from The Cursed Child. I will link that wand review up above and down below. That was of all the videos I've done so far on the channel is my most successful video which just blown away by that but it as I was saying very very bendy and it tapers down into more of a darker brown and sort of black colour. I just love the style of this wand. Now I do not know if there is a metal wand rod I should say running through this or not. I am very unaware of that so I'm being very very careful. You hear if it decides to show on camera sometimes it doesn't because it's so small is the copyright information. 
this wand I believe as it is a noble collection wand is probably around the 32 pound mark now I do not completely know the price and must admit I haven't completely looked into it because it was a gift from mum so I don't want to be completely made aware but noble collection ones in the Ollivander's design of box are usually around £32. The cheapest cost that this would possibly be is the same price as their character one boxes which cost around £27. But those character one boxes are only available for your Harry Potter characters. All the Fantastic Beast char characters apart from Jacob come in more of an Ollivander style box and I believe most of them do say Fantastic Beasts on the top of the box. But because this is a Secrets of Dumbledore designed box, the Secrets of Dumbledore ones may come exactly like this. I will put Noble Collections link down below so you can check it out for yourself. At the bottom of the box, as I should have mentioned, it gives you all the copyright information. It says Jacob Kowalski, Fantastic Beast Noble Collection, and it's got the Warner Brothers copyright information on it as well. It is just stunning. Noble Collection is one of those companies that I cannot recommend enough. Their wands are just such good quality. They put so much effort into their collectibles and so much detail. I will be collecting some of the other Fantastic Beast ones. And I will do individual reviews on each of them as I get them. I currently have, other than this one, two other Fantastic Beast ones in my collection. So if you would like to see reviews of those, please let me know in the comments down below. And I will schedule those in sometime this year. If you have enjoyed this video, please give it a like. Let me know in the comments down below what you thought of the Jacob Kowalski Noble Connection wand. If you have enjoyed this video, as I said, give it a like. Don't forget to subscribe down below and turn on that notification bell so you're notified when more magical mischief is coming your way. I really hope you have enjoyed this magical review and I will see you very soon, guys. Bye!